2025 has been an incredible year, not just for Flock Aerodome, but for Jonah's first responder programs across the country. Flock Aerodome has partnered with over 100 public safety agencies this year in developing the most advanced DFR program available. Today, I'm here to announce the future of Jonah's first responder technology. Imagine, as a DFR pilot, you're responding to an Amber Alert vehicle. You find the vehicle and it's driving down a busy highway. Now all you have to do is click the vehicle on the screen. The drone's camera will automatically start following that vehicle. But it's not just the camera. The drone itself will also follow the vehicle, matching rate and speed, and pulling behind the vehicle so you can naturally zoom your camera and read the license plate without having to do anything else. Even if the vehicle momentarily drives behind a building or a tree line, the drone will continuously follow that vehicle and recapture it as it exits that building area or the tree line. Everything from tracking suspects to high-speed pursuits is now just one click away. Most DFR programs are operating out of real-time crime centers today, but that doesn't mean every DFR pilot has multiple people there ready to assist them at any given moment. Things as simple as reading a license plate can take another pair of eyes and sometimes another pair of hands. That's why now all Flock Aerodome drones, even the ones that we've integrated, are ALPR cameras that fly. They'll automatically read the license plate when you zoom in and cross-reference your hot list to see if it's gonna generate a Flock hit or not. If it does generate a Flock hit, that hit will go to Flock OS, Flock Nova, and Flock Freeform. This allows the pilot to focus on the task at hand, which is safely piloting the drone. These new software features make it very easy for a single pilot to fly a single drone as effectively as possible at any given time. But what about flying more than one drone at a time? Sometimes you need to fly one drone to replace another drone on scene. And sometimes you need to fly multiple drones to multiple calls for service. Today, Flock Aerodome now supports multi-drone functionality. This allows one pilot to decide which drone they want to launch at any given time and launch multiple drones as needed. Each drone can be flown through its own window deconflicting by itself. This functionality is fully compliant with recent one-to-many FAA waivers issued to other agencies, allowing for pilots to fly more than one drone at a time. We've talked about flying one drone at a time. We've talked about flying multiple drones at a time. But how do you fly a drone to a 911 call when no one is sitting in the drone pilot's chair? Agencies have told me personally, I love the idea of having 24-7 drone stations, but I can't yet do 24-7 staffing especially on Wednesday graveyard shifts. The answer is simple. You shouldn't need to be sitting at the computer to launch a drone to a 911 call. That's why I'm excited to show you the new Flock Aerodome mobile app. The Flock Aerodome mobile app allows users to fully launch and fly a DFR mission from their iPhone or Android phone, wherever they are. All you have to do is pull out your phone, clear your aircraft and airspace, and then select your mission. In this case, let's just go to a live Flock LPR hit nearby. All right, so we'll select the nearest drone station, and then we just launch the drone. You can still fly the drone via mobile controls in the same way you would on a computer, and you have nearly the exact same functionality. The drone can be easily dispatched to calls automatically with just one click. When you're on scene, you can easily use your zoom and thermal capabilities to check your surroundings. You can check your airspace easily, and of course, the app will alert you anytime an aircraft enters within a mile of your drone's airspace. The drone will still automatically deconflict from aircraft as they enter your airspace. When you're done with your mission, you just click return home and you can watch the drone land on its dock, getting ready for the next mission in short order.